Well, I mean, that's the great thing about our team. We have so many guys that can score the ball, so many guys that can, you know, defend. So when we're on the court, we pretty much just your turn, my turn. If I'm on, you, I'm on. Pass me the ball. If you're on, I'm going to pass you the ball because we just respect each other's games and we know that each other can put the ball in the hole. So definitely. I mean, they're our only loss in the Big 12 conference right now. Um, so, we, you know, we slipped up in that, at, at Ames. So we just knew that we had to get him back because that's the last time we're going to see him probably until on the Big 12 tournament. So we just knew it was the last time we could get him back right now. I mean, it's, 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 he needed he needed that because he's been such a great teammate this year, and he hasn't even performed to the level he can play at. I mean, that wasn't even the highest he can play at because he has another year that he that he reached tonight, and it's something that is definitely a, a pedestal for him, a stepping stool for him to continue to move forward and be be a great player like he is. Like I know he can be. You know, I mean, Wayne is one of my like I look up to Wayne so much because that he has a great attitude all the time. He's a great teammate. He's a great leader, and um, just for him to have a great night like this, and I just see that he's more upbeat. He's a little happy. His jumper's been. All in all season, he just hadn't been able to shoot a lot in the game. So, you know, tonight was the night that showed that he can be a good player. Yeah, he had a little bounce in his step. Um, he had a little after after the game interview. Um, it was a great game for him. It's just been a great day for him, and it's, just, it's definitely he's gonna only gonna get better from here. And um, we're gonna continue to follow him, and we're gonna continue to uh, grow along with him. Definitely. That's one of the biggest reasons uh, why I had such a slow start because I thought I was gonna have to do way more than I had to do, pretty much. And then uh, when I, once he said, you know, you can calm down a little bit, and not not do as much, I was kind of confused as to where you know what he was talking about. And now you know I kind of see that a lot of great guys on my team, and there's a lot of great guys, you know. That can, that can play the game of basketball. It's not just me out there, so it's kind of more helps, helps me be more comfortable. Yeah, I mean, when I said I was sitting watching other guys, you know, they weren't, it, they made the game look so easy, uh, like Brandon and Wayne, they made the game look so easy in practice. So I was just like, what am I doing differently? So I just kind of, you know, just got in the gym and just worked on the little things in my game and just kind of helped me. Yeah, we just knew that they were slow getting back on uh, defense. So they, they're fast getting back on um, offense and they're slow getting back on defense. So we kind of just tried to capitalize on that. And um, 30 points in Ames, fast break points to 12 uh, back home. We, def we definitely did something different. Uh, we just have to keep pushing forward and getting better because we know it's not it's not over. We have a big tough one at Oklahoma State coming up uh, this Saturday, so we have to continue to get better.